Flights are taking off and landing right now at Lindbergh Field this evening, but the massive attack has prompted an increase in security there as well. Our tennis reporter Jessica Chin is there. Jessica, you've got some important information for anybody going in and out of Lindbergh right now. That's right. All flights out of San Diego to Fort Lauderdale have been canceled. And you can see on the board over here, this is a JetBlue flight to Fort Lauderdale. It says it's been canceled. Now, an airport official told me that they've also increased security here at the airport. It's not because there is a threat, but they're doing it just to be extra safe. It's a little unnerving, especially when you're traveling on the day when something like this happens. Tony Cacciopudi was preparing to fly into Fort Lauderdale Airport today. Yeah, it freaked me out. I mean, it's, there's no doubt about that. It's, you know, that sends panic to you. He just spent the last five days in San Diego at a conference and was ready to go home. It's horrible that, uh, you know, there are people that were killed. Tony says he heard about the mass shooting after getting a text from his wife this morning. You're vulnerable no matter where you go. Tony says he's connecting through Atlanta, and that was on time, but his flight to Fort Lauderdale canceled. Checked our flight. Everything was uh, still on time and, and go. I talked to the gate agent um, when I checked in, and they said that there's no hold. Everything's a go right now. Tony says he'll likely be rerouted to a different airport in Florida. I may be spending a night in Atlanta or get rerouted to Palm Beach or Miami. And as Fort Lauderdale Airport remains closed for an unknown amount of time. I'm going to be looking over my shoulder in the baggage claim area. He says he's keeping the memory of the victims close to his heart. I pray for the families you know, who are affected by this. I think it's a horrible thing. Now, Fort Lauderdale Airport is completely shut down, but anybody flying today is asked to check their airline. At Lindbergh Field, Jessica Chen, 10 News.